is 11.55 p.m. I was just enjoying the sunset. It's amazing how there are still people out and about. Maybe other people getting off work, like me. But I just went to visit a friend, swing by. She made a smoothie. She saves me some. I already drank like half of it and it's really good. So this is essentially my dinner. There was a couple snacks that I had left that I have not shared yet. <laughs> I tried to cut my fingers off this evening. Thankfully, they don't hurt. I got a variety pack. <laughs> I'm, I know I've had this before. I don't know what it's called. Of course, it's all in Japanese, so I can't read it baked bean cake so it's what they look like right there and on the back it shows i'm assuming what the flavors are supposed to be which of course i can't read if i can open this with my fingers hmm. no picking my nose i guess there we go show it child bro <sighs> Ooh. This is like some tough plastic, man. Look at how pretty that packaging is. Oh no! Run away. It's so pretty. I don't want to eat it. I don't want to open it. Um, been quite a while, probably about a year since I've had this. I love the packaging. They're so pretty. I think these are more fun to play with than to actually eat. It's so soft. Feels fake. <laughs> oh. <gasps> okay, that's gonna be hard to explain. Yeah. It's definitely more fun to play with. Okay. It's like the consistency of butter and sugar. I know that might sound gross. But like just that texture wise. Dissolved sugar and butter. <laughs> that's as close as I could come to describing what that's like. Huh. The other ones, I know, are like that. These are about the same. Just I went with one of these. Just smaller size. Look at that packaging. Look at that. I wonder if the green is like the matcha. Like matcha tea. Tastes like tea. So what might be the other flavors are? Different forms of tea. Like a ginger or who knows what. I'm not a big fan of matcha flavor. This one looks more of like a cherry blossom. I just love how small they are. It's another yellow one. It feels like dissolved sugar in butter. Like when you're making cookies. I love the packaging. It's so pretty. And the plastic is so Thick. That was very interesting. Something I did want to share is one of my favorite chips. Honey butter chips. I first had these when I was in South Korea. I learned to open this from this end instead of the top side. There's mosquito. If you leave it flat like this, you can pick them out and eat them that way versus sticking your hand into the bag and grabbing it and getting your hands greasy. They do have a slight honey butter taste. It's like honey butter spread, but on a potato chip. It works somehow. I don't, I'm not sure. You grab a section here and I rip it like that. It's really easy to rip. Just tear out a big circle. <laughs> I 
and you have easier access. All right, for example, now you have a giant hole in the bag. <laughs> and you just grab like that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Giant potato chip flakes. <laughs> They're large and beautiful. Yep, and that's how it is. 